Hey, CDN Game Guys viewers, what is up today, peeps? Today I am doing another League of Legends for noobs. Yes, for noobs. I'm not saying I'm excellent or anything, but um, I guess I could be the noob. Anyway, um, I'm playing Ash here, doing a round of domination. You know, I think we lose, but um, we do pretty good, or I do pretty good. We had uh, Y, who was, or Master Y, or whatever his name is. Was AFK. He comes back for a little bit. We start winning when he comes back because we just needed that one more man to do a little bit of harassment. And then he goes AFK again. It really pisses me off sometimes. But anyway, I start off with the boots of swiftness just for the mobility boost right off the start. So, um, I would love to know in the comments the builds that you guys use for Ash and Domination. Um, what attacks you go with right off the start what order you use your attacks and so your rotations and stuff. I'd love to know this because I'm trying to become the best overall League of Legends player out there. Actually, I'm just trying to become good with a lot of different characters because I get addicted to one character for a bit, but then I get bored of him like three or four months later and it's like, now I'm going to go play another one. And I would just love to put a variety of videos out there to help everybody out. So you might be wondering why I haven't made a video in the past month or so. Well, I did a transition from going to school to working full time. I finished one semester. Um, did pretty good in it. I dropped. I went through from two classes because I didn't like them. They were machine shop, and I just I was gonna probably end up failing machine shop. And I just myself, I can't let myself fail, so I just withdrew from them. I probably should have stuck with them and just tried to do it. Who knows? Might have came out passing and kept going in the program, but uh, it turns out I got a full-time job, could possibly turn into an apprenticeship for an automotive mechanic or technician in the near future. Kind of hoping for that, if that doesn't work out, probably end up going back to school next year for something in the automotive field. We'll see. Only time can tell what it will bring. Anyway, here we get in our first little fight. Um, their Master Y is following me. Decides to pull off, which was probably one of his worst moves ever, because I think his team could have handled my guys up there. But he obviously felt that they couldn't. So he decided to um, pull off, try to pick me up, and boom, another kill right here for me. So like I said, I'm not doing bad with Ash, but I would love to know your guys' builds. Um, tell me if, no, you gotta do this, because this will get you the best start in the game, and we'll build to an awesome later game. Um, like I said, I don't know much, I don't play Ash much, and this Master Y sucked here, because he probably easily took me out. But he was like, ah, no. He thought he was going to try to draw me into the tower, I'm like, <laughs> no. I honestly die, almost die like three, four times here. It's really, really funny. It's right here, I'm like, ah, the minion is chasing me, run away. So anyway, I hope everybody had a good Christmas, because I am recording this one on Christmas. I didn't play it. The game I played at Christmas Eve, but I'm doing my recording for Christmas, so I'd like to wish everybody a Merry Christmas. Agreed. And a Happy New Year, if you guys don't hear me back from me before the New Year, which is very unlikely, because I'll probably have two or three videos coming out in the next week. Um, now I'm working full-time, I have, like, you, I come home, I don't have to do anything, I don't have to do homework. Um, I mean, I ended up, actually, <laughs> I say that, but I end up, like, I don't even know what I do during the night. It's weird, like you go to work and some days are long, other days are like really short. But it always seems the days at work feel way longer than the days you have off. Because like today it's 10 or 11 o'clock at night now. And when I woke up this morning it honestly was 9 or 8. And I don't know where the day went. I honestly have no clue. I know I play Saints Row 3, Battlefield 3 a little bit, and some Starcraft 2. But that was about it. I don't know where my day went. So here... So, okay, let's talk about Ash a little bit. The way I play with her is a little bit is kind of run up, get the damage off, run away, don't stay in one spot too long, don't get caught. But sometimes I lose my focus and I get caught, I know that. But I'm very unsure about the build, the way I should be building her, what attack should I be picking off the start, what item should I be picking up, that type of stuff. I got no real experience with her. Um, as you can see, sometimes I get like the perfect arrows, other times I don't. So messed up. I don't think I was paying attention there much. But um, yeah, actually I go to the BF sort next. Um, I think I go into Affinity's Edge. 
so as I said, Master Y is AFK. We could have been owning them because we're like pushing them back. It's really funny. They actually admit too that we they would have died if, even if Master Y was a complete noob. He would have been able to do at least some sort of damage, and we would have been able to take him completely out. But yeah, so actually, here's uh, the comment for the day. Question comment of the day. Give me your best gift for Christmas. Um, I know Christmas isn't all about getting presents, but just whatever gift you feel is best. It doesn't have to be like the most expensive. It could just be the one that you really, really want it. Um, my best gift was probably uh, an iPod docking station for my vehicle. Just because going to work, you know, radio stations aren't always that good or going anywhere. And I do a lot of traveling right now. Just because, I don't know, spend my time doing something. So, got an iPod docking station for whatever vehicle I'm in. And uh, it comes in actually really, really clear. But my only worry is the iPod falling out of it when I'm driving. I don't know. I also got a bunch of DVDs, and I do like DVDs and some games, but I like this the best. So. Actually, we're working on a website right now that's going to have, like, you join, like, you register for it. So look forward to that. I'm also getting a capture card. It's paid for. I'm just waiting for it to be come in, shipped to me. Uh, I bought it online, 100 bucks. I forget what type it is already, but um, it's nothing like ultra good. But I, for 100 bucks, I think you get what you pay for. I didn't want to pay for like a hop hog or something like the 500 bucks because I'm kind of cheap. But I wanted something where I could record some Xbox gameplay and you know make some cool stuff with it. So hopefully that comes in in the next couple of days. Hopefully, I got a fart. One second, yep. Okay. Oh, there we go. So, freaking, this, like, something I gotta say, though, is this month has went by super quick. Like, I remember my birthday, which is on the 6th, and after that, the month, and then it's like the 25th now. And then you got New Year's. It, it just went by super, super quick. Oh. can't wait I cannot wait until you know make some money working full-time um, buy some stuff to make some cool YouTube videos and you know just keep pumping out some good content uh, I want to keep my subscriber content up I love your input to help make not just like my gameplay better here but my videos and actually I am building towards infinity edge um, I'm not sure like I don't like looking up on forums and stuff. I'd rather play through and find my certain play style. But again, I would love to hear your input. Um, would you build the Infinity Edge first or go attack speed with Ash? I built the Infinity Edge because I just wanted that little attack damage bonus. But I'm thinking of getting the BF Sword and then getting some attack speed. Would that be better? Um, yeah. Any mistakes you see me make in the video, feel free to point them out. Um, this is to help me and help other people looking to learn to play Ash. I'm trying to, you know, keep everybody interacted. Um, I'll be making more videos with the improvements. What I found that helps, like say, you tell me, oh, you're supposed to do this and this, and you'll be good. Um, I'll try them out. I'll make videos of it. I'll put it all together, and I'll show you where I improved. I'll just keep making constant videos. Got a World of Warcraft video coming out in the near future. Like I said, I got StarCraft 2 now and Battlefield 3 for the computer, so look for some of the gameplay from that. Getting a cap card, so you'll see some Saints Row 3, which I already beat like 50% of it because that's probably where my day went. Boxing Day is tomorrow. Gonna go for some shopping. That should be really, you know. Yeah, hell. Hey, look, Wise playing back, and we see, like, when Wise started to play, we took, like, three cap points and we were holding them and we did good actually we do fairly good we get them down to almost even with us all the way down to the end and then they beat us because they obviously have that extra guy and sometimes like when you get up to the higher levels it's harder to counter them it's yeah here we go that's actually I like the way I use that arrow I felt like that was actually perfect teamwork there um, we 
we are unstoppable. So, I've actually been watching Dexter season all day today too. I want to start watching my Big Bang Theory. My mom bought me Ice Age, a Merry Christmas special. Yep. Gonna watch that sometime. Not sure when. I'm gonna watch it. Got it. Bought a bunch of stuff. One thing I want to buy for my room is a massage, like one of those uh, seat covers that has like the massagers in them. Thinking about buying one of those sometime. And a beer fridge. I gotta buy a beer fridge. I don't condone underage drinking, but once you're of age, do whatever you want. I, actually, I want a mini fridge. I don't want to call it a beer fridge. I want a mini fridge in my room and a microwave. I'd also have to put a bathroom in my room, and then I just, when I'm home, I just wouldn't have to leave my room. I could just lock myself in my room and, you know, be good. But that never seems to work anyway, because people always need something, and they can't get up and do it themselves. I'm complaining when I live in my house for free. But, whatever. <laughs> I seem like a fucking moron to myself right there. Anyway, um, so yeah, I built the Infinity's Edge, and then I went into some attack speed, I guess. Like I said, I'm I'm not sure the way to build the Ash properly, so if I could get some help, I would be more than willing to listen to it. Like I said, I don't seem to do bad with her. Actually, they seem to be doing fairly good with her, in my opinion. I'm running around, I'm owning people up. You know, you gotta you gotta own them up. You can't just sit back and just let them win. You you gotta own them. You gotta do everything. Um, if you want to play some League of Legends with me, I will leave my champion's name in the you know the bar below. Um, if you want to play any games with me? You know, feel free to message me on YouTube. I read them constantly. I read every single comment. Try to respond to it. And uh, remember, subscribe. Help us out. Help us grow. Who knows? Maybe eventually we can be an awesome YouTube channel, like one of the big ones. But, um, you know, I'll keep making videos even if we're not. Just because I like to make videos. I'm actually putting a lot of work into a montage. Or, not like it's not a montage, but it's a bunch of different owning moments from League of Legends. Um, right now, of mine. It's halfway done. I got a World of Warcraft video coming out. I said that. It's, there's a really cl close one that's about is like me opening the Christmas presents for World of Warcraft. I'm gonna do something cool with that. Um. Oh, what else do I got planned? I got some plans, but I'm not I'm not willing to reveal them all right now. But there is some stuff coming. Um, don't fear. Probably going to. Uh, I can't wait till I can start doing the Xbox because then I can. Uh, record like gameplay with all my friends that I play with around here and Call of Duty actually here well, I gotta say something about Call of Duty right now is it me or Modern Warfare 3 is all about the gunpowder or gunpowder <laughs> it's all about the gun skill or not gun skill gun power it's like the, if you have that overpowered gun no matter how good you are you're gonna get that one shot the guys not even have a chance to react I don't I don't like that I like uh, Black Ops where it could take a couple bullets to take you down that way you have the chance to react so it's not just the luck. It's it's more. Yeah, I have skill. I can't believe the way they did Modern Warfare 3. It's. I don't think I'm gonna buy the next Infinity Ward. It's too random to me. It's like, oh, this time I will kill him. Next time, oh, my knife won't hit him. I, I don't know. I'm gonna make a video on it when I get my cap card. But I don't think I'm gonna buy the next Infinity Ward one. I definitely buy Treyarch because Treyarch seems to be doing good. And if, yeah, so definitely gonna buy the next Treyarch because I like the way Treyarch's doing theirs. Well, it actually depends what they're doing with it. Who knows? I admit I do like the kill streak system and in Infinity Wards, but uh, Treyarch got everything else right. I find it funny that Infinity Wards said their maps are gonna be more, you know, even leveled. They're not gonna have the high points, and then they put the high points in, and it just it seems to me that their game was so lazily done that their map their guy just sat there and was like yeah I'll throw a car here throw another 20 here and yeah that, that's good enough for this map it was, it's just so cluttered it's stupid I don't like it um, I don't know why I bought it actually I bought it because it was a Call of Duty basically and that's probably what they were thinking they're like oh we can do whatever we want 
But again, that's gonna come and bite them in the ass, cause I know at least four of my friends aren't buying it next time out of my five friends, or <laughs> out of my friends so far that have played Call of Duty. Out of the five friends of mine who own Modern Warfare 3, they're not buying the next Tra or Infinity Ward game. They're gonna buy the Treyarch, but not Infinity Ward. So yeah, kind of screw themselves there. It's they're idiots in my opinion. They like, should just you know. Even if they just take what Treyarch was doing right, make it modern, um, improve on some stuff, change like the kill streak system, it would have been a good game. Even just taking Modern Warfare 2 and putting the new kill streak system in, upping the graphics, keeping the same type of map styles, like less clutter, like fuck, stupid maps, stupid, stupid maps, worst maps than any Call of Duty. I don't like any of them. They're all stupid. But um, yeah. So, I think I die here, I pretty much get owned. Or actually, no, that wasn't me. I was paying attention to someone else. I don't know why I shot, actually I was trying to reveal the area. So, how should I be playing Ash? Am I playing her right? Um, what should I be doing with her? Any pro Ash players out there, please give me the tips. Um, I have a couple other League of Legends videos that are being produced, I guess, as we speak. But this is the, um, this is actually, I feel like I didn't do a bad job with her. I would also like you guys to rate my Ash playing skills out of a 10 in the description. I honestly would give myself a 7. It's not perfect, but in my opinion I'm doing some pretty damn good work with her. For not playing her much, not really knowing her build. Keep in mind, I don't go look stuff up. I, can't, I play around with stuff. I, I look at the character. I read her lore, I read her base stats, I look at her skills, I judge this is what type of build I should be building on her. These are the runes I should be using. Actually my runes are set for Master Y. I would change hers just a little bit, but I'm not sure how. I'd keep attack speed though, because she, she benefits from attack speed I find. Um, in my opinion Ash's attack speed and damage and mobility is her major thing where master Y you really like you do attack speed and life steal a crit more than you deal with mobility because he's got pretty fair mobility himself and when you build the rest of the stuff his mobility goes up enough or find ash you get the boots of swiftness I might throw another mobility in there what call one defense item and that'd be my build never really got to fully build her out um, yeah so and I also like to hear your opinions on domination it's been out for a while now three or four months or whatever six months maybe not three or four three or four it hasn't been six months so I'd love to hear your opinion on the domination game mode do you like it better than let's call it all the other one classic um, I do in a way I do in a d another way it's it's got its benefits up and downs and there we go. Oh, I didn't get the kill. Oh my god! That we have tired. See, like, we're coming down to the end of the game here, but with if our Master Y was not AFK, I have a feeling the game would come out in a very different way at the end. In my opinion, I think we would have probably won the game. Yeah, probably, most likely. But unfortunately, man, it doesn't always happen the way you plan it, so you just kind of got to do what you gotta do and hope it comes out in the best um, probably should have ran away here but I'm like yeah my people are in combat I'll try to give them a hand and I think I'm dying here I'm not sure I think I overcommit myself just a little bit too much maybe, maybe I'm not sure ooh dodge that we're just owning up here Boom! Damn it, Ramesh, you got fucked up like a new. I love how like someone kills you, they're like they're OP. You kill them, you're OP. It's it's really really funny in that way. <laughs> See, like right there, I think we should have just fell back and monitor our points. I think that's where we made our mistake. I think we might have been able to one win if we just played defense instead of trying to push. But I don't know. I felt I guess we pushed because we thought we could do it but turns out we could um yeah 
So I hope you guys all had a very Merry Christmas. Um, hope it was good. Hope Santa Claus came down. It was good to you. Like he was good to me. It's always good to me though. No? 19 years old and um, I still believe in Santa Claus because, you know, he's real. Watch those TV shows. People don't believe in him, you know. Then all of a sudden he comes out of the sky and they're like, I guess I believe in Santa Claus. Some of those I don't really understand, but, you know, they're good. Um, please check out our blog spot. It's got some new movie reviews. Freaking Sherlock Holmes 2. Awesome movie. Really awesome movie. Definitely want to get that when it comes out. Uh, going Boxing Day shopping tomorrow. I have no clue what I'm going for, but I'm just going to spend my money because I can. Got to work Tuesday. Really not looking forward to that because it's the weirdest transition in the world going from school to work. Like going from school where you get two weeks off at Christmas to going to work where... I got like oh, I got four days off basically, but it's again it's like um, yeah four days off really I used to get two weeks off that's like and then it's when the summer comes it's gonna feel really weird when I got two months off and now I get nothing that's I book that's I book two weeks off in the summer but I don't I might. I think I'm booking one off in March and one off in August. And who knows? Who knows what's going to happen? I'll do a whole video or speech about my college some other time and why what I chose over what I did. Explain all my decisions. Maybe it will help people deciding to go to college. I'm not really sure the age of my audience, but I kind of think it's. I know it's mostly males because, you know, <sighs> females can't listen to me without, you know, getting a little bit horny. It's. It's okay. I know it's true. See, I like how we. Maybe we win this. Maybe we do. I don't think we do, but maybe we do. I could go either way here. I'm actually unsure if we win this or not. I'm actually very unsure. I'm starting to think we can win this. Maybe. I think we do. I don't think we did, but maybe we do. Holy shit, we do. <laughs> We won with a guy AFK. Huh. That is very surprising to me. I didn't think we won this. Anyway, peace out gamers. Please remember to subscribe, like, and comment. See you guys later.